Hello and welcome back friends. Today we have the mnemonic about the diaphragmatic openings and their contents. So friends, our mnemonic is inferior epigastric artery. Yes friends, inferior epigastric artery. The first question that come to your mind that why I have taken inferior epigastric artery as a mnemonic. So friends, the answer is it is a unique artery. Yes friends, inferior epigastric artery. If I change the position of I in between E and A, so by shifting the position of I in between E and A, you can find EIA, that is external iliac artery. Yes, which is the origin of inferior epigastric artery. So friends, this is the uniqueness of this inferior epigastric artery. So friends, now we have IVC opening, esophageal opening and aortic opening that is EIA inferior epigastric artery so we can remember by that the sequence is IEA now friends just put 8, 10 and 12 serially and put T in all the segments so friends now IVC opening is at the level of TA esophageal opening at the level of T10 and aortic opening at the level of T12 now friends, it is about the content. Yes, the aortic opening by the name itself, we can obviously say that by aortic opening, aorta passes. Now, in the aortic segment, we can find A and T. Yes, A for ejagus vein and T for thoracic duct. Now, in esophageal opening, which is at the level of T10, it is vagus nerve. The important structure which passes through, it is vagus. Vagus supplies the esophagus and the whole GIT by its parasympathetic supply and also by sending secretomotor fibers. So, Vagus will always be in the esophageal opening. Now, the IVC opening, which is at the level of TA. So, friends, just give a scratch by the lower segment of A so that it looks like P. So, now, the P for phrenic nerve. That is right and left phrenic nerve passes through the vanicoval opening. Now friends, it is about superior epigastric vessels. So it will be unfair if we don't take about superior epigastric artery because we have already discussed about inferior epigastric artery. So friends, the superior epigastric vessels pass through the foramen of Morgagni which is a small opening in the diaphragm. So friends, now it is balanced because we have discussed about both inferior epigastric artery and superior epigastric vessels. Yes friends, our mnemonic is finished. If you like this video, please let me know in the comment section and also give your valuable suggestion regarding the topic about which we should make mnemonic. So friends, keep watching Medico Mnemonics and see you in the next week.